Hey y'all, what's up? My name is Sonali. Welcome to my channel. If you guys are new, definitely hit that subscribe button. And if you guys are already subscribed, make sure your post notifications are turned on. Today I'm doing something a little bit nerve wracking, and that is laminating my own brows. I bought this kit on Amazon for $26 and I've gotten my brows professionally laminated once before and I'm pretty sure it was almost a little over $100 and I loved the look. They said it would last six to eight weeks and it definitely lasted the whole time. I also got a lash lift with it as well and I love that too. These are my brows now. They're pretty thin to me, but when I got them professionally laminated, they were so fluffy and looked so thick. I didn't even know I had all that hair under there and it was just like magical. So I wanted to try it out home and see if I could save a little bit of money and do it myself. Um, I am a little bit nervous because you know, you're putting chemicals on your brows. So hopefully it turns out well and I will link this kit below. But let's get started and open this up and see what's inside. Usually I'm not good with reading directions, but since we're playing with actual chemicals on our face, I'm going to read the directions like a hundred thousand times. So first they say to take the cleanser and cleanse your brows a little bit. So I just have like a cotton pad. Next we're going to apply the eyebrow lift glue. So this is where it gets serious. I'm a little nervous. Um, but I'm just going to take this brush and apply it and then they said brush it out with a Y-shaped comb or something But I have no idea what the hell a Y-shaped comb is and it doesn't really say but in the picture they use this white one so We're gonna use this first and then maybe Brush it out with a spoolie. I'm not really sure how much I'm supposed to be putting on like I feel like I just put on a pretty thin layer So I think I'm gonna go back over it Just do one more layer just in case now it says to wait 30 seconds and then brush it out. It's already feeling a little stiff. <laughs> I brought in an extra light because I feel like it wasn't very lit on the side of my face. The next step is to remove the eyebrow lift perm and apply the eyebrow fixation. Then cover your eyes with a plastic wrap waiting 10 to 12 minutes. So how do we remove it though? Oh my gosh, I was literally reading. <gasps> guys, guys. I literally skipped a step. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I went down instead of boop, boop, boop. I'm so stupid. The step that I missed was apply Vaseline around and under the eyebrow. Um, and the kit does not include the Vaseline, so cool. I actually don't really have Vaseline. I wonder if Glossier <laughs> Balm would be just as good. It's a good thing I figured out that, uh, I was missing some steps on step, step number two and not step number like six. That would have been scary. I'm actually stupid. There is a box with Y comb written all over it. See, this is this is why I should not be doing this myself, but gotta save some money, you know? It's starting to sting a little bit. Not horribly, but just a heads up, it does does tingle. Next we'll apply the eyebrow perm lotion with this little micro brush. Okay, now it is time to get out your plastic wrap and wrap your brows. <laughs> this plastic wrap needs to chill for about 12 minutes, so I'll be right back. It's been 12 minutes, so let's take this off. They already look so good. Like they look like they've been professionally done. We're not done yet though. Um, so the next step is to apply the eyebrow fixation lotion. And I'm still confused because the next step reads, remove the eyebrow lift perm, which is on my eyebrows right now and then apply the eyebrow fixation and then cover eyes with plastic wrap again. So I'm just not sure how to remove it. Like, do I just like brush it off or do I just remove the plastic wrap? So I'm not really sure, but I'm just gonna go through with like a clean brush and try to get as much off, I guess. So going in with the fixation lotion, I'm just gonna use this brush because that's what it has in the picture. Oops, okay. 
They're starting to look a little crazy, but like at least it's working. So we actually have to put the plastic wrap back on. So let's do that. I also recommend to put the plastic wrap on, like still on the roll and then like rip it off because I literally wasted <laughs> like three little plastic wrap things because they would just like fold. Now we have to wait another 12 minutes with this plastic wrap on. Now it says to remove it with this micro brush and then we're gonna take like a damp cotton kind of thing or a cloth and actually go in and remove all of the residue. I'm not really sure if this little thing is doing anything. Look at my brows first of all, like they look a little crazy. So hopefully they like chill a little bit. I know the first day when I got my brows professionally eliminated, I was like in shock because I was like, they look a little funky, they look a little crazy. So I think it's probably gonna be the same kind of situation, but at least now this time I'm not in as much shock. Wait, this is kind of weird because it literally says do not get eyebrows wet for the first 24 hours, but it says utilize dampened cotton with cold water. So maybe it's not supposed to be fully wet. So maybe I just fucked it all up. I don't know. I'm, I'm now I'm getting a little nervous. It's telling me to go back in with the cleanser to make sure I got all of the residue off. Going in with a little eyebrow nutrition. Here are the final brows and usually they'll like cut the tops, but I kind of like them a little bit fluffy. Or what I'll do is take a little spoolie. This is like the one that broke, but I will just kind of like comb them to the side a little bit so they're not sticking all the way up. I'm actually pretty happy with them. I'm really, really hoping that they last just as long as when I got them professionally done, but I will definitely keep you guys updated on my Instagram story. So if you guys wanna go follow me on Instagram, it is so underscore gnarly without the G. I will have the brow elimination kit linked in the description box so you can check it out for yourself. Let me know if you guys do try it, send me before and after pics, and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye.